Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke. Also, Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. So today I'm opening up Antop Merrick from uh, Rogue One, the um, Star Wars Black series. So I picked this up a good few weeks ago from Star Action Figures, who've always got a great, um, great sale on. Uh, $12.99, let your eyes be your guide. I think it's a great figure. I, I've, I've always liked the look of it, um, and um, I picked up the... Uh, what was it? The um, Rogue One X-Wing. So I've still got that to open. Let me just quickly let it pass over <laughs> the screen. So I've got to open that up. That was, um, what was it? That was £55.99 from Zavi. Definitely let your, let, your, let your eyes be your guide on that one. I thought that was a good price. Now that's, that. I've still got to open that up. Um, one of the one of the, the delays, I mean, I, what's it? I bought it last year was, um, I didn't have anywhere to put it. I don't want to just um, open it and then um, put it up in the loft. So I think I've got a space now. Because I really like the look, the, the actual colour scheme. I've, th that was one of the things I liked um, about that particular X-Wing and Top Merrick when I, um, when I watched the Rogue One movie. And it's also uh, <laughs> one, one of the reasons why um, I, picked up, I picked up the figure. Because I, th I think he looks, I think it's really, really good. Um, I was going to say, I've only, <laughs> I always say this, I've only recently got into the Black Series Star Wars figures, but it must be a good good six months. And it's, <laughs> and it's all big, well, it's all since Ed from New York sent me that massive box of uh, Star Wars figures, which, you know, which I'm still, <laughs> still getting through uh, slowly. But yeah, this is, this is a top quality figure. Um, so I, um, I, I picked up quite a few um, Black Series figures from Star Action Figures uh, during that particular order. They've got so much stuff. Definitely worth uh, checking out their uh, their website. But I I do like these uh, the the box art on these uh, on these uh, figures and particular waves. I think I I think I've I think I've nearly got the um, what is it? You know the the um, the Obi Wan Kenobi series. I think I've almost, must be like one or two that I don't have, I think I've almost got the whole set of the Obi-Wan Kenobi series. I never thought I'd ever own an entire wave of uh, Black Series figures, but it's, a lot of it is to do with the, um, the great sales that have been, been happening over the last, uh, what, six months or so, from um, well, Star Action figures, Lame, we won't, you know, I'm over it now. Um, so yeah, definitely... Uh, Definitely worth watching out for the deals. And as I've mentioned previously, I've kind of stopped buying the uh, the new waves. It's, I just I just think they're a little bit too expensive, and I'm getting a bit a bit more of a nostalgic buzz by buying like old vintage toys. So yeah, some of, <laughs> some of Star some of Star Wars my Star Wars vintage collection. Um, action figures it's sort of on hold on hold at the moment and you know unless unless things change with the price or unless uh someone has a massive sale but anyway back to uh back to antok so uh yeah i, I am looking forward to opening the um the actual x-wing and it, i know there's there's been a lot of um there's been a lot of stick for that particular x-wing because it's the same mold from the uh from the 90s because i've because i've i've still got my um was it Power of the Force 2 Luke Skywalker Special Effects uh, <laughs> X-Wing, uh, which I thought was great. And I know it's got a, a little issue with the wings, but and they've used exactly the same mould, but it's, it's not that bad. I think it's all right. The uh, Poe Dameron, the orange X-Wing, I've got that as well. I've still not opened that. I got that from um, the Disney store. Um, but again, it's, it's all about trying to find room, and I will, I will find room for them. But... Um, yeah, twelve. What was it twelve ninety five? Not a bad price. Not a bad price at all. So let's uh, let's get this guy open. Right, you all know the drill by now. Always open your Black Series figures from the bottom of the box. And this is what we're dealing with. Look at that, that is a great sculpt on there. 
Oh, honestly, um, first impressions, it looks absolutely fantastic. So let's get it, let's get Antok out of the packaging and have a have a proper proper look at him. Well, look at the sculpt on that. I mean, this is a really, really nice looking figure. Beautiful, blue, beautiful blue eyes. I love the uh, the kind of Air Force tash. I think it's a great, I think it's a great figure and a really, really good price. I saw, I saw in the, uh, I think I really like the blue um, flight suit. And I saw in the Ahsoka trailer that um, one of Admiral Akbar's um, like relatives, <laughs> I'm not allowed to say that. He's um, he's wearing like a blue flight suit, uh, similar to um, oh, who was it in um, uh, was it in the oh? Do you know what I can't even remember what series I was I was watching. Oh, in the Mandalorian, you had um, the guy from Star Wars Rebels. He was wearing a blue flight suit, I think, as well. I can't remember what his name is. Oh. I really like it. Let me know, let me know in the comments below. What, what, I can't remember what his name was. The, oh, I can't I can't remember. But anyway, really really impressed by this uh, by this figure. It looks really good. Um, yeah, I mean it's, it's got pretty good articulation for obviously flying flying his X-wing. Imagine if you had a, a Black Series X-wing because I've got the Black Series uh, Tie Fighter from uh, the, the sequel trilogy. But imagine having a, uh, an X-Wing, that would be amazing. Imagine how big that would be. But yeah, no, it's got really nice, really nice details on there. And, and it is still for sale on uh, Star Action figures. So it's, I think it's definitely worth, uh, worth picking up at that price especially. So I'm just gonna have a look at his, uh, his weapon, well, his accessories, his, his, his gun and his, uh, his, hel his helmet. Right, so here's his weapon. That's not a bad weapon at all. It's um, it's not the thickest plastic in the world, but it's not it's not bad. Nice little paint applications on there. I like the silver on the end of the uh, on the end of the barrel. Nice little touch. Quite happy with that. I think it looks really good. And let's just check out his helmet. And there's his helmet on the end of my finger. I've just remembered who that guy was called. It was called Zeb, I think. Who wore the blue flight... Do you know I'm probably wrong about that as well. I'm sure he wore a blue flight suit in The Mandalorian. In the uh, last uh, the last series. But yeah, that's, that's a nice... That's a nice helmet. So, that's a lovely detailing on there. So I'm just going to put him... Um, Put all his accessories on and see what he looks like. I think he looks great. Um, I was a bit worried about putting the um, the helmet on because uh, I don't know if you can see here. It was really hard to uh, to get the chin guard under his chin because uh, I was worried I was going to break it. Because. Um, I don't know. I've had a few bad experiences with Hasbro goods <laughs> in the past, but that no, went on well. I don't know if I would display him with the helmet on. I'd probably have him holding it in his hand. It's a shame there's nowhere for his gun to go. Um, but at the end of the day, it's a flight suit. But it would have been nice if he had somewhere to put his gun. But yeah, it looks really, really good. I also I spotted this: the detailing on his glove, the little silver bit. I I, I love it. The detailing is great. I like the character, I mean, I suppose I'm biased because I like the character. I really enjoyed Rogue One. I think it's a great movie. Uh, <laughs> I'd, I'd, gi I'd give this figure, I'd give it 10 out of 10. I think it is, I, I think it's, I think they've done really well. It's something a bit different. And it's from a, it's from, it's from a really, really good Star Wars movie. Which, uh, which a lot of it was filmed in a, uh, in England and also it's uh, you know it's connected to the Andor series and I've, I've I still maintain that the Andor series um, I think it's probably the best series out of all the 
Star Wars, Star Wars series on uh, Disney Plus. But we've we've still got Ahsoka to watch, and I'm <laughs> I'm quite excited about that. But no, really, really good figure. Great applications. I think he's got brown boots on as well. I'm pretty sure they're brown boots. But yeah, 10 out of 10. Let your eyes be your guide. Still available at Star Action Figures, 12 95 And as I always say, if you want if you want to keep the boxes, order from Star Action Figures. If uh, if you're not fussed, you know, and you, you're just going to dump the boxes, by all means, order from Amazon. But as you know, I've had a few bad experiences from Amazon and uh, and also Lame, but I'm, I'm over that now. And Lame have still got some good um, good figures. Uh, not too much now in the, in the stores, but they've still got some good stuff online. But anyway, that's the uh, end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. And I will be opening up some more um, Black Series figures I had planned to bring, well, when I was <laughs> when I was going to Senegal, because uh, I was going to be near the beach, I had planned to bring a few figures with me, including the Shore Trooper, because I wanted to take some photos, because I've, I've not really taken photos of Black Series figures on the beach before. Um, so obviously that, <laughs> that holiday got cancelled at the last minute because of my wife's uh, two slip discs. Um, and then obviously I had the, I had the, unlucky, uh, <laughs> the, the unlucky holiday to uh, Dubai when my son broke his leg but um, I'm, going to, I'm going to the beach I'm, I'm, I'm playing it safe this time so I'm going to I'm going to the beach in um, well I'm staying local I'm staying I'm staying I'm, I'm staying in England so I'll be going to the beach I will definitely be taking some of my figures to uh, to open so uh, stay tuned for that but um, but yeah until then I'll see you in the next one